after? Uh, no. So then the captain's responsible for this? I'm afraid to answer that question. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Captain, this is a violation of the article of war. I found a person in <coughs> your regiment who has been assisting me who is falsely enlisted. Griffin. Take one look at this person. Is this Max Seabor? Sam Seabor? Well, whatever her... Whatever your name is, they, he says it's her, his cousin Molly. Let me hear your story. Are you who he says he is? He is my cousin. Um, Lying to an officer is probably not a good idea. Falsifying records, lying to an officer. But why did you join? Why did you, why did you want to fight for the United States? Well, my brother's not in this unit, but he's here, and my cousin's here, my family's here, and I want to do what's right. And I have medical knowledge, and I've proven that. I've packed so the I wound, hope we're and keeping your more. hospital busy. So <laughs> I've been able to prove myself, I feel like. Keep it moving along. Well, I think I commend you for your service, I commend you for your dedication, but unfortunately, you jumped the line in the protocol. There are places in the Union Army for nurses, but not when they falsify records. So, uh, unfortunately, we're going to have to place you under arrest. We're going to have to place you under arrest pending a legal review. You falsified records to get in, and you betrayed our trust. Your service is commendable, we appreciate it, but we're going to have to take you under arrest. Sergeant, Sergeant, could you tell it up with Jeff. Take him under arrest, please. Yes. Let's go. Molly. Um, what happened to the husband, right? Molly, <laughs> <laughs>